Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across a repairing disk error message. This is repairing disk errors. This might take over an hour to complete. So this should hopefully be appreciated for our process here, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. The first thing I'd recommend doing would be just to be patient and actually let it finish the scan. Some of you guys are very impatient and you want to just, you know, everything to be done within you know, 10 seconds, but some things are not that quick. And this is one of those things. So I recommend actually just coming back to your computer in a few hours and seeing if it's finished at that point. If it's still running after say 12 hours or 24 hours, then you can do a hard power off on your computer. And then once you're done powering off, just boot your computer back up and then you would boot back up to Windows here and you would open up the search menu type in CMD, best match, come back with command prompt, go ahead and right click on it and select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, select yes. And now into this elevated command line window, type in SFC, followed by a space, forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash out front. Go ahead and hit enter on your keyboard to begin the system scan. This will take some time to run, so please be patient. Okay, so you can see it did find corrupt files and successfully repair them, which is good. Something else we want to run here as well would be a check disk scan. So type in chk dsk space forward slash r, again exactly how you see it on my screen. So chk dsk, then a space and then a forward slash r. Hit enter on your keyboard. So check this cannot run because the volume is in use by another process, which is normal. Uh, would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time your system restarts? Tap the Y key on your keyboard, hit enter. The volume will be checked the next time the system restarts. So go ahead and close out of here and actually restart your computer. And I'm not going to actually run the check this scan because it can take some time to run, but you just don't want to tap any keys on your keyboard. It's going to say to cancel the scan, tap any key on your keyboard within like 10 seconds, you're gonna see it up on the screen here. So in your case, you're not going to tap on any key. I'm gonna skip the disk checking because I don't wanna make this video too long here. But in your case, do not tap any keys on your keyboard and let the scan proceed as normal. And there you go, guys. So hopefully once you run both of those scans in their entirety, you should be good to go. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do about to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.